Hey there, everybody. Chris Beatty is here, editor of Grower Talks, Green Profit, and the e-newsletter Acres Online, welcoming you to yet another episode of Trending Now, where we introduce you to some of the coolest new products coming out into the greenhouse marketplace. And today we're going to be talk talking to my friend Kip McConnell. Kip is the director of Plant Development Services. You might know them as PDSI. And uh, welcome, Kip. Glad to have you here. Thank you, Chris. Glad to be here. Now, where are you broadcasting from today? You're, I think you're here in Alabama, Loxley, right? Alabama, right Loxley. on the Gulf Coast, as far south as you can get in Alabama. All right. A beautiful part of the world down there. Forget the fact that they call it the Redneck Riviera. Just focus on the Riviera part of it because it's nice. Down <laughs> exactly. <there. laughs> uh, and, and Kip's company is known for uh, uh, to be to, known for being the exclusive licensees for uh, brands like uh, Encore Azalea, uh, Better Boxwood, and um, the two really popular magazine brands, uh, the Southern Living Plant Collection and the Sunset uh, Plant Collection. And I think this variety you're going to introduce us to today goes into, well, somewhere in all of that stuff, right? Let's share the yes, screen. Yes, We're going to be talking about, uh, there it is right there. We're going to be talking about Touch of Gold Holly, an Ilex Cranata. Tell us about this one, Kip. Yeah, Chris, this is a great new addition. Uh, it'll be uh, primarily in the Southern Living Plant Collection and also available for sunset for growers in the Northwest. Um, but it's a great new holly that we're introducing. We really love, first of all, that catches your eyes, that bright yellow color. I mean, it is just, just really amazing the color that this plant has. And it'll brighten up any landscape. And then the other thing we love about it, too, is its dwarf habit. So it, it fills a niche for grow people that would love a low hedge or a small growing mass planting item that can really give you that great, you know, yellow color for your landscape. And so just two feet high, so, but a nice yeah, spread, you, four feet spread. Yeah, yeah, so it's it's very low and it's very easy to keep that way. I mean, you, you know, it, it takes well to a little bit of pruning, but it's it only has a medium growth habit, so not a really fast grower. So it keeps that nice dwarf size. So again, for small areas and small hedges, it's just perfect. Golly, and I love the uh, the the contrast, you, you the that that bright, bright foliage. That's really what has to make it stand out against all the other uh, Ilex uh, Cranatas out there in the marketplace, yeah? Yes, yes. And and the other thing, you know, Ilex Cranatas, like you said, they're, they're very well known. They're widely used. And the reason they are is because they're they're good plants. They're very tough, disease-resistant plants um, and, and easy to grow. And this one has all those characteristics as well, but then it adds that just brilliant yellow color to it as well. Yeah, now where does so, it come again, from? It, it comes from a breeder in North Carolina, Pat McCracken. He uh, he was also the breeder of one of our most popular plants, another yellow plant called Sunshine Ligustrum. But this is a much smaller plant and much more um, easier to keep, um, you know, keep a small compact size to. So um, so we're excited to have this be another part of our offering out there for people that love these variegated foliage plants. All right, it looks really good out there in the in the landscape as well. And what I like about, uh, and I've told you this many times, when you've got a plant that's in both those magazines collections, you know it's got to be a really good plant. It performs in the you know the southeast and out west as well. But you did make the caveat: this isn't all of the Sunset Marketplace. You said just like the northwest portion. Oregon, Correct. Washington, yeah, Oregon, it, it, it will only be able to, to do well up there. But the thing also is this is a zone six hardy plant. So it's got a wide range uh, of area that, that it can be grown. So you can go to the middle of the country all the way to the coast in the south. So there are a lot of people that are going to be able to enjoy this in their gardens. Yeah. Don't stick it in deep shade, though. Part, part shade. Yep. It needs full sun to part sun. Uh, the sun really, you know, makes that yellow coloration pop. Um, so too much shade and it'll get a little green on you. But, you know, full sun, part sun, you're you're golden and it will be golden. Just bright yellow. All right. Now I'm, uh, I want to grow some or I want to retail some. How do I get the darn thing? So we've got liners available for growers now. And we also have growers that will have it uh, finished product available for retailers this spring. So look for it or ask for it. Um, but you will see these and you can't miss them. You can't miss them, you know, out there on the yard or on a table in front of the consumers. It really stands out. It's a really showstopper. 
All right. Well, beautiful. So that's Touch of Gold Holly coming very soon. Uh, I expect we'll get to see it in person out at the, uh, the California Trials this year. We're going to. You will. You will. We will have it there. All right. So watch for it there at all the trade shows. I imagine you'll uh, you'll be uh, correct we'll start with uh, with Nance this spring. But who knows when people are watching this? Anyway, Touch of Gold Holly from Plant Development Services, part of the uh, Southern Living Plant Collection and uh, the Sunset Plant Collection. Although not for all of that that area out there. Kip, thanks for sharing that one with us. Appreciate Thank it. Thank you, Chris. All right. Well, on behalf of uh, Kip and everybody at Plant Development Services. Uh, and everybody here at uh, Ball Publishing, I'm Chris Beatty saying thanks for watching this episode of Trending Now.